Welcome to a Scopus video tutorial on citation overviews. In this example, you want to review the citation history of documents that relate to research into lunar habitation and structures. You run a loose phrase search on lunar habitat, the Boolean operator AND, and then structure. You also decide to look at OR build and add the asterisk wildcard for both search terms. You select the All option at the top of the document list on the Results page and then select View Citation Overview. This option allows you to create citation overviews for up to 2,000 documents. When the document count exceeds 2,000 but is still beneath the upper limit of 20,000, you will see a prompt to request a download. You would then enter your email address and submit your request to be notified when the file is ready. Once the file is ready, an email will be sent with a download link to the CSV file. The link will remain valid for one week. In this example, however, the results page contains fewer than 2,000 documents, so your citation overview opens. You select 2006 to 2020 in the date range drop down menus. You can exclude self citations and or book citations, but you leave both options unchecked. Click Update. The graph shows an increase in citations over time, with the table below showing the documents and citation detail. You are interested in documents with a high citation impact. You resort the documents, so the highest citation count appears at the top of the table using the drop-down menu at the right above the list of documents. Note, the total column on the far right does not reflect the 2006 to 2020 date range. Instead, it shows the total number of citations received by each document. The subtotal counts all citations within the selected year range. You can also view citations by year. All numbers are hyperlinked, allowing you to open a list of the citing documents.